Hi everyone. So last time we saw data visualization using two important Python libraries, Matplotlib and Seaborn. So in this video, we are going to see another two libraries, which are Plotly and Bokeh. So let's see how it works. So this is my notebook for the data visualization using Bokeh library. For more details, you can check out the blog. So a couple of things you have to remember is uh, when you have to output uh, show the output in the notebook you have to use the notebook underscore output and if you are outputting it in a dot html file or something output underscore file is there so while importing you have to import that thing so i have plotted multiple plots the one of the attractions i found about bokeh is plotting the interactive graphs so i did one interactive graph and you can see i can add the widget and i can change you know i can see the variation along the years for the years so this is about bokeh the same thing applies to my uh, data visualization using plotly plotly also have a couple of things that whenever you are plotting it inside your jupyter notebook you have to say i plot and then it will show in the jupyter notebook itself so there is a blog also associated with it and you can check on it and Plotly also gives you the interactive uh, kind of uh, graphs you can have the hover over like uh, effect on that and you can plot all kind of scatter plot box, plot histograms pie chart donut graphs everything box chart so you have different kinds of plots so Plotly is also famous for you know this is one health chart which is the financial chart and then it has the maps so yeah plotly is also famous for 3d kind of uh, interactive maps so for more you can refer in my blog as well as the links provided in the notebook thank you for watching please do subscribe to my youtube channel and uh, also follow me on my github youtube and facebook and twitter as well as you know uh, check out my blogs for more theoretical details for particular things and uh, yeah till that time happy learning and sharing stay tuned bye for now